child learns differently. And so if you just do a CAN program while you're reading out a textbook, you may not be reaching all the learning modalities of every child in that class. So I try in my classroom to touch every learning sense for every child to make every kid walk away with something. She's really kind. I want to come down to her class more than I get to, so that shows a lot of how great she is. And there's animals, a bunch of animals that you would never think to be in a classroom, like um, Bob White Quail, a bearded dragon, snakes. Red black. and yellow kill a fellow. Oh. Black red, and yellow. Red, red and, and black, black is a friend of Jack. She is so resourceful in finding ways to get the kids engaged. They start to recognize that science is in the world around them and it permeates, you know, everything that happens in their lives. Even kids who struggle with all the other contents find a love for science and they find a way to excel with her. It's a unique classroom and there's so many things to see and learn and you get to go outdoors and really feel the way that science has helped the ecosystem. My daughter was really inspired here seeing gardening. So since then, we have created a garden and every year we plant. It opened Kate up to so many different things that weren't part of her life. Last year, we recycled 5,000 pounds in can and 50,000 pounds in steel. It all started with the metal recycling project. From recycling and we started generating money, it kind of evolved into our garden program we have. Then we started getting birds coming in, which was exciting. So then we uh, started doing our birding program. They're black skimmers. See if your group agrees. Black. Guys, look at it. I can get a black one. Let me lock it. Just the endeavors that she takes on for the benefit of the kids requires this extra time, but it doesn't seem to phase her because she enjoys it so much. So we can always count on her to be here early and to be here late and to be here on the weekends. Years down the road when high school students come back to me and still remember the little life lessons they learned in my room and tell me that, that they're going to take that with them in their career and their life down the road, it doesn't get any better than that.